The Clippers announced that Kawhi Leonard will miss game three of the Western Conference Finals. He suffered a right knee injury against the Jazz in game four. I reported on his injury a few games ago. As I mentioned in that video, if Kawhi has a knee sprain, we could see him back in these playoffs. However, as I stated, if it's more severe, this will certainly be an issue. And from the video and my perspective, I think Kawhi's injury is likely to be more severe. Look at the video. It's here where Kawhi's right knee plants slightly extends and then has a rotational torque. The way he pulled up and the way the knee looks to me on video tells me it's leaning to be a near complete ACL tear, which is the ligament that helps stabilize the knee. Although it still could be a sprain. As of yet, the Clippers haven't ruled out Leonard returning. They've listed his injury on the official injury report as a right knee sprain. And if Kawhi has an ACL tear, he clearly will miss the rest of these playoffs and will be out for nine to 11 months. A few fans wanted to know if he could play on a slate ACL tear. Well, the problem with ACL sprains is that they tend not to do very well and have a predisposition to number one, either get re-injured easily, Number two, a sprain of the ACL may have some of the fibers torn or what we call a partial ACL bundle tear that leads to continued instability of the knee. Or number three, if he tests his knee and it just doesn't feel right, he may just need surgery sooner than later. Thus, in a professional basketball player that has to cut laterally on a hard court day in and day out, having a very solid ACL is paramount and why ACL sprains just don't do well in NBA players. We will wait official word from the team. Kawhi, I wish you a speedy recovery.